Okay, Carly, because you've got the itches on your paws because of this awful weather, so much mud and rain, and they get really itchy paws, both of them. So we have a little routine, don't we? We're going to show everybody a routine. Okay, we start off with cleaning the paws, don't we, with the dandelion? Yes, you shouldn't really lick it. Carly, you're not supposed to eat it. This is his paw cleaning regimen. Good boys, Dirly. We're getting a paw clean and a paw bath, aren't we? Okay. And get treatos while you're having your paws done. Watch out. Collie, sit. Good boy. Then we make a paw bath with the betadine solution. Oh, good boy, Collie. Yes. This is a povidone iodine bath, which helps with this nasty itching, doesn't it, Stirls? Yeah, you got the back paws in too, haven't we? <laughs> like a ballerina. Good boy, Stirls. They make you feel better. I'm going to put the silver shield on your paws. Now they're all clean. It's got your chicken leg up. <laughs> Does that feel better? What about you, Coles? What do you think? What are you looking for? <laughs> now, look at that. All relaxed and happy. I know, you still want to lick a little bit, but it does definitely help and make you feel better, doesn't it? <laughs> they're just licking because they're clean. You feel so much better now? Yes, it feels good, doesn't it? Nice and clean. The last trick is because obviously they're still going to want to go out before they go to bed. So what do we do? We put your little booties on so they don't get re-dirty before bedtime. Oh, hey, I'm trying to get them off. <laughs> You're crazy. Yes, you was licking your See, it isn't a cure by the way, but I just want to keep as much bacteria out of his paws as possible so it doesn't just keep getting worse. And he is on antibiotics already because he also gets like a little rash on his undercarriage. So yeah, and he's going to have to have a shot, I think, aren't you? Yes. I don't believe this is food related either, the itches, because it only comes at certain times a year and definitely in these awful muddy times, which we've had so much of this winter, haven't we? When it's cold, it's not so bad.